Hi folks, this is your MWIS fleeting view looking into the weekend in association with Petzl. A similar weather story over the next day or so at least with rather grey and damp conditions, locally better in spots to the north of the major hill groups and a few high summits trying to poke through the cloud at times. Fairly benign conditions on Saturday, the wind a bit stronger especially across Scotland during Sunday and with that will come a drop of temperature too with a cold front moving through. The chart for Friday at least sees high pressure still centred toward the east of us and a southeasterly airflow prevailing, the wind strongest and gustiest up the west coast of Scotland during the daytime, fairly extensive cloud sheet, one or two holes in that cloud breaking through, temperatures on the mild side but not feeling that pleasant in still quite a damp atmosphere. Looking at the cloud map and it tells the story pretty well with the best of the breaks indicated by the darkest grey colours toward the north of Scotland and across the north northwest of Wales as well and some of the highest summits trying their best to poke through the layer and just get above the cloud but it will be quite a marginal situation with just some of the highest tops trying to poke out of the cloud. A few breaks developing west of the Pennines, Cumbria might start to see some clearer spots trying to form but overall I still suspect a rather murky and damp atmosphere, particularly at lower elevations, pretty widely. Northern Scotland faring best for the warmest temperatures and the best of some sunshine. Onwards through Friday night into Saturday and still that damp atmosphere is around with lots of low cloud and murk to start Saturday. Again, one or two breaks in that sheet will be across the northern portions of Scotland and a few of the highest tops will try again to poke through. But I think the cloud deck may just be a touch higher for some on Saturday. The cloud base itself may lift a little bit through the daytime as the wind picks up a touch in western regions. But overall, it's a quite benign day with temperatures still relatively mild. Taking the story onwards into Sunday and some fronts will start to move in from the west and that will bring a zone of patchy rain and drizzle, fairly persistent across some western hills, some heavier rain for a while in western Scotland as that front comes in and that will pass eastwards during the daytime. Then breaking up into showers uh, with quite a drop of temperature as well behind that cold front. That's how it looks on the synoptic chart with the cold front passing eastwards across Scotland with a drop of freezing level to around 1100 metres during the daytime so some showers will turn to snow on the Munros during the day. Some brighter conditions though trying to emerge away from showers across western Scotland once that front does clear through but in the warmer air mass ahead of the front and around the warm front moving over England and Wales it is rather grey, murky and damp again. Strongest wind speeds for the day will be across Scotland, particularly toward the northwest, strengthening during the daytime. Light winds, though, overall for the south for England and Wales. A quick look into next week, and high pressure is building from the south again to give a settled outlook overall. Some sunshine around on Monday, a bit more widely than previous days, with lower humidity. Rather chilly, though, across the tops, especially with a brisk westerly breeze over Scotland. Temperatures near to freezing point on the higher mountains and feeling well below zero. Touch of frost in a few sheltered spots first thing in the morning as well. Milder air wafts around from the Atlantic though on that westerly flow by Tuesday and temperatures will come up well above freezing again by this stage and more humidity is drawn in so there's more in the way of cloud once more across western mountains in particular. Best of breaks further eastwards. A bit damp on some coastal hills but overall not too much if any rainfall around. One or two showers may just run down the eastern coastal portions of England. That may not affect the mountain groups as such though and it's high pressure that dominates later in the week. So some low level fog, some stubborn areas of low cloud could be in that picture again, but a relatively mild story still in that outlook. All your local details for three days ahead as usual on our website. That is your fleeting view in association with Petzl. Thanks for watching.